Hello and welcome back to another Black Myth Wukong guide video. In this one we are going over how to complete the Zhu Dog quest who is a character that unlocks a shop with permanent stab grades for your character using mind cores as the currency which you get from most boss fights. It's not a tough quest line to complete and while we're at it I will show you a secondary quest nearby that unlocks a second shop with some unique items inside of it. Let's take a look. At the start of chapter 2 next to the village entrance shrine you can walk along and jump down to fight the Lang Li Gu Ba frog boss and after he's defeated you can walk up the stairs and talk with Zhu Dog. He will craft you some potions and that's all you need to do for this part. Continue on with the story until you reach the Crouching Tiger Temple and at the start of the temple is the Tiger Vanguard boss. Defeat the boss and then interact with the stone altar to drain the blood and you will access the cellar of the temple. Follow the path all the way to the sand hill you slide down and you will find the cellar shrine. Next to the shrine, Zhu Dog will appear inside of a pot and when you speak with him he unlocks as a vendor who sells some really useful items like permanent stat upgrades for your character. So as I mentioned it's not super difficult to do but it's someone that you want to unlock as soon as you can in order to get all of his useful stuff. The second shop is located in the Fright Cliffs Squall's hideout. From the fast travel head up the hill and into the cave where at the top there is a stone enemy to defeat. If you have not done so check out my first video for collecting Buddha eyeballs that is also in this location if you want to collect them while you're here. After he is defeated you will get a key item, head all the way back to the fast travel and then this time we're going to head right, follow the path until we come across a man stuck in stone. You need to interact with him and then he will attack you and once you've defeated him you can leave the area and return and he will open up as a shop that sells unique stuff. So guys that's it for this Black Myth Wukong guide video. If you want to see more useful weapons, armors, quests and secrets for all of the locations in game, like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye.